And I was reading something in this book about being goal-oriented versus having an intention behind the things that you do, and it made a lot of sense because I always talk about intention in class. And I'm like, you have to have an intention for class. You have to have an intention for what you do. But she said it in such a way where it was like, if you just have a goal, like, oh, I want to become famous, right? She was talking about actors. It was like, if you have as a goal, like, be famous, everything in between is going to feel like work, like a burden, because you're always kind of like anticipating when you're going to get famous. However, if you're like, oh, my intention is as an artist to be able to express myself and find things or whatever, even if you never get famous, it's always going to be significant. Right? So I want you to, before I play the music, I want you to think about that, right? Like, what is your intention in general for your dance, right? And like, can we switch that mentality of like goals and like put it into like a mentality of intention and use that in class today? Because it happened, it's happening a lot with us, right? Where it's like, okay, my goal is to be the world champion. And yes. then, <laughs> she's the world champion. She's the world champion. I have two world champions here, but you know, yeah. No, but like, I think that what's happening is like a lot of the times it's like, that's the goal. And then in between, it's like, you're, you're, you're just looking for that validation, right? You're just looking for that end thing. So then you'll do anything and everything to win versus if you're like, okay, I would love to develop myself as a dancer and use the competition as a drive to motivate me to want to do it better and see how far that will take me. So even if you lose, you went through that kind of journey, right? So I really want you to think about it because we need to become more intentional in our dance so it's not just the same all the time, right? So you're not just learning steps, so you're not just learning things that other people are doing, so you're not just copying feelings and styles and moves, right? So you can actually develop as a dancer because I think everybody wants that, but we're not so clear how to get there. And that's the way, finding your intention. Does that make sense? So think about it while I play my song and then we'll